Confident and ready for action, the Bulls, as they headed to the locker room earlier on. The hometown crowd certain to give them a warm welcome. The Chicago River winding its way through the heart of the Windy City, our site tonight. Well, the weekend obviously is in full swing, and so is the NBA. Hey, thanks for joining us on 2K Sports and our broadcast team tonight. Greg Anthony here to my left and Steve Smith to my right. And the Hall of Famer, David Aldridge, along the sideline. And a look here at the passing numbers over the last several months for Kyle Lowry. He hasn't been nearly as effective a passer these past few months, and, and that's unfortunate because when he's passing it well and the assists are coming, he is a much more complete player. It's something he has to be thinking about. We are nearly ready for the tip-off, but first, let's hear from our very own David Aldridge. D.A., it's all yours. Hey, Kevin. The Bulls last season missed the playoffs for the fourth straight time. Coach Billy Donovan said, you've got to enjoy the process, the struggles, the joys, the pain. You take both ends of it. There's always opportunities to grow and learn, and that's what's important. Kevin, the Bulls are hoping for improvement. Donovan knows what he's talking about. I think he's on the right track. D.A., thank you. You know, Steve, above the rim play always is captivating to watch. We should see some of that tonight. Yes, Kevin. A lot of watch ahead because these guys can fly. I'm glad I'm watching and not trying to slow these guys down. So the opening lineup for the Heat. Adebayo is the pivot with Tucker playing the four. And Robinson on the wing. He's joined by Butler. And it's Lowry in at the one. And for Chicago, they've got Zach Levine. Vucevic is out there at the Rose. Then there's Dosumu. And it's Caruso in at the two guard. It'll be the Heat off the tip. Lowry with the ball. Boy, he was something else against Boston. Right side, Butler. Six on the shot clock. Shoots over Vucevic. That one Jimmy a tad Butler. offline to the right, but drops in for him. The closer the better for Jimmy, but his strong mechanics can make the mid-range work. Levine against Butler. Levine's shot is off. The defense ready for him on that possession. They had to be because he is so strong in the paint. Here's Lowry. That one misses. Great D that time from Vucevic. Caruso looking for an opening. Oh, here's Dosumu. Defense is right there. That's something you hate. You're trying to come in with an aggressive mindset, and that early foul could take you right out of it. Heat on offense. A little over a minute gone here in the first quarter. Adebayo passes to Lowry. Some nice ball movement here by the Heat. Tucker finds Lowry. Hits the three-point bomb. Lowry. Kyle looks confident in everything he does. And that confidence rubs off on the team. Levine dishes to DeRozan. Pass to Vucevic. Lets it go with a three. Rebound by the Heat. Now here's Lowry. Tucker the pass to Robinson. Now here's Adebayo. And Adebayo throws it down. Nice work in there by Adebayo. He sets a physical tone for this team. And here is Dosumu. To the left side wing. Here's Caruso, guarded by Robinson. Looking to end the run. The shot, no good. And it's Miami the other way. Outside Butler. There's the pass to Tucker. 
Butler on the way. To the middle. And Tucker kicks to Lowry. Here's Butler. Played in with a nice touch Jimmy off the glass. Butler. And the story here, Kevin, early on Time is how the well they've shot the basketball. And the first timeout of the game called for Chicago. And really hard to find more intense players than Jimmy Butler. This guy is 100% focused on winning at all times. One of the ultimate competitors in our league. Now, here's Dosumu. Vucevic to the pass to Caruso. Into the lane. Levine wide open. Gets the three-pointer to fall. Slick shot by Zach right off the pass. He just goes straight into his motion. And with Butler and his intensity, Greg, it's a perfect fit for him in Miami. And yeah, it can rub some players the wrong way, but it goes hand in hand with the culture here. Hard to imagine Butler on a team other than Miami. Now, here is Robinson. Still getting warmed up offensively. No scoring yet from him. Here's Autobio. Right through the D for the layup. And not hard to see why they are giving up points on this run. Just too many good looks from in close. Outside, Levine. And it's off from three-point range. They are out of rhythm. One for five so far. You just need to calm down and reward your matchups. Bulls trail by eight. There's the drive. And Levine throws it down. Levine. An explosive move there by Zach. Quick first step, then a thunderous finish. And so Lowry will bring it up for the Miami Heat. Passes it to Butler. Inside. Here's Autobio. Levine with the rebound. Bulls have gone two or six from the field. Got it. And he's now three for five from the field. He has length and he has athleticism. Both of those help him operate inside and beat good defenses. Here's Lowry. And a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. That one on Vucevic. Such a great all-around player. Kyle Lowry. You know, G.A., a star who's also a glue guy. He takes the temperature of the team and gives it whatever it needs whenever it's needed. And maybe we don't talk enough about what a great teammate Lowry is. Passionate. He leads by example and always vocal. throw drops for Kyle Lowry. When Lowry won gold in 2016, the U.S. team coaches had very high praise. Yeah, you, you can call him their unsung hero. The best team player out of anybody. This guy shows emotion and guys feed off his energy. And so Lowry nails both of them. Money from the strike. He does a great job night in and night out. Levine finds DeRozan. Now Vucevic. Oh, no good on the three. Here is Lowry. Five points in the game. Up top, Adebayo. Vucevic with the block. Well timed by Vucevic. Not a center who piles up blocks, but this guy picks his spot. And we just got a second look there at the exceptional mobile one block. And right out of the gate, trying to set the tone defensively, you got to love that energy. So it's Miami now. Six-point lead. And it's Butler missing. Levine looking around, fires it up. It's hauled in by Bam Adebayo. Adebayo's got four rebounds in this game. Vucevic against Lowry. Tucker the pass to Adebayo. There's his third field goal, and now he's made half of his six shots. 
Bam is a pro at absorbing contact, especially when he's locked in on scoring. Levine for three, and it's Miami with the rebound. Now Lowry, Robinson for three. DeRozan with the rebound. Levine against Butler. Pass to Dosunga. Wide open. And again, no good by Chicago. The Heat leading by eight. Outside Lowry. In the corner, it's Robinson. Off target there. That would have pushed the lead to double digits. Outside DeRozan. Levine for three. Good. And it's DeRozan picking up the assist. Levine's got ten points. That's good awareness from DeRozan. Spots the open man. That speaks to his all-around game. And the first time out of the game called for the Heat. Al Smitty, opening day is upon us. You excited for the new season? I am, Kevin. First of all, you love seeing the new rookie class, how they fit in. Second, a lot of these teams with a lot of trades and moving parts. And some of these franchises that have acquired new coaches. Tristan Thompson, he's checked in for the Bulls. And then for Miami, Martin's checked in for P.J. Tucker. And it's Victor Oladipo in for Duncan Robinson. Ferocious finish. Bam's natural strength is next level. Now here's Dosumu. He's still scoreless so far in this one. Butler against Levine. And Levine with the slam. This is what we've come to expect from Zach Levine. Poetry in air. Now here is Lowry. Not a lot of room. Outside, Mark. He kicks to Oladipo. Shot clock at six. Butler against Levine. And he sinks that one in the back of the rim on the way in. He has six. He's hot this quarter, getting the shots he wants, and he's delivering. Levine dishes two to Rosen. His first shot is a miss, 0 for 1 to start the contest. And, and already they staked out a noticeable advantage in terms of aggression and controlling the backboard. Woo, blown opportunity right there. Won't get many chances easier than that one. That's in, and he found his range with that one. Now one for two. Keeping the dribble, inviting contact. DeRozan's become a master at converting these. Here's Butler following the score by DeMar DeRozan. Down low, here's Adebayo. This will blow, his basket is good. So a chance here for a three-point play. That's his first. His shot taken has been superb this quarter. He's taken over this game. And let's get your take, guys, on the scoring breakdown for the Heat. They've gotten a lot of high-quality shots in the paint early on. That was clearly part of their game plan coming in. And also another aspect of their game that's been super so far tonight is how they've been sharing the basketball. And Bam Adebayo, picked 14th for in the, the 2017 draft, has made huge improvements throughout his career. Guy is a hard worker. Time called here. The Bulls decide to talk it over. And Coach Spolster says that Adebayo continues to put in the work to improve. And Kevin, you see it in his game every year. Never takes a summer off. Comes back each fall with a new wrinkle to his repertoire. Here's DeRozan. And DeRozan throws it down hard. Incredible leaper, explosive finisher. DeRozan with one of his acrobatic dunks. Oladipo outside. Good ball movement here by Miami. Adebayo kicks to Lowry. That's in, coming off an assist from Adebayo. The assist. That's seven points ben for Kyle Lowry. Lowry. Lowry against White. Pass to DeRozan. Driving the lane. And DeRozan throws it down hard. You have to love the way DeRozan went at the rim. He knows he's at his best when he's the aggressor. The pass to Autobio. 
kicks it to Oladipo. The three. That one, no good. Now Chicago takes it the other way. DeRozan with it. Boy, was he something else against the Clippers. Jones drives in, and he banks in the layup. And now just a four-point Miami lead. And it's coming easy for them right now. Five baskets in a row in the paint. Passes it to Autobio. Butler in the corner. Pass to Lowry. Pulls it from the elbow. And good. Got the friendly bounce off the right side of the rim. And the Heat lead by six. We've got to love a veteran point guard. Lowry keeping his eyes up and his options open. An intentional foul committed, but for what purpose, Greg, I'm not sure. A, a scene of confusion right there. I can't imagine why he thought it was a good idea to foul there. Tyler Hero. He's checked in for Kyle Lowry. Now here's White. He's gotten some minutes, but nothing on the board yet. And finished off by DeRozan. Good heads up basketball from Kobe. Spots a wide open shooter and gets it to him. Hero finds Martin. To the inside. Here's Butler. And it's Butler with the jam. Yeah, I mean, maybe could have tried for a more memorable dunk than that one. And we know he's capable of those memorable ones. Now here's White. 11 point game is last outing. The dish to Williams. Shoots from the block. Oladipo with the block. Man, you're not going to beat Oladipo with that. I mean, Victor plays hard on both sides of the ball. Green, he's checked in for Chicago. White, wide open, he fires. Good, and he's green, picking up the assist. Kobe White making it rain from distance. Woo-wee! Over in the corner, Hero. Tried to answer back, but that three is off the mark. To the paint, here's Green. And he floats in for the easy two. Credit the assist on that one. And guys, they continue to put a lot of pressure on the interior defenders with their work down low. Here's Hero. And there's two points. Hero. Working on the glass, paying off that time. And the Heat lead by three. And so it's Williams who brings it up for the Bulls. Thompson outside. There's 42 seconds left to play here in the first. And it's White missing. Not quite enough defense. That time around, just lucky he was off. Now, Hero. Coming in off a 12-point game, his last outing. Deadman passes to Hero. Traps in the tray. Tyler Hero. Now it's a six-point Miami lead. And they've done the job on the offensive glass. Poke loose and stolen by Deadman. Hero kicks to Deadman. Back to Hero. Shoots over White. Misses off the left eye. Guys, Bam Adebayo getting it done for Miami. Scoring, rebounding. He was all. Kyle Lowry, always one of the league's leaders in charges drawn. He sheds light on the significance of that play. It's a real life momentum shift. You know, it really boosts myself, my team, and it really takes a lot from the other guys because they think they have a play, a dunk, a pass, an assist or something. And it's like, no, that's not there. And it's a foul on the other guy, maybe the star player, maybe the shot blocker, maybe anybody. And that's what I do. I do whatever it takes to help my team win. Andrew Lowry, all of six feet tall to absorb those collisions, sacrificing his body, it shows what he's all about. And like he said, whatever it takes to win. That pit bull mentality, 
And he's got the strength to weather the physicality. Obi-Wan! And if you're just joining us, we've played through one quarter in this one. And let's quickly break down the game we've seen from Miami, guys. Well, one way to generate more offense, pound the offensive Tyler glass. Hero. That was the difference in the first. And you know this, most of the time, offensive rebounds generate high percentage looks. In a moment now, to reset the lineups, courtesy of Gatorade, all fueled up for the second quarter of basketball. And for Miami, look at who they've got out there. Adebayo is the pivot with Tucker playing the four. Tyler Hero out there with Victor Oladipo. And it's Struce in at the three. Hits some rim Tyler on the way Hero. in, and the bucket's good. Hero's got nine points. Look at the speed of Hero's shot, keeping him ahead of the defender so they can't block it. Vucevic finds Levine. Miami grabs the miss. Another rebound hauled in. They're hitting the glass with a lot of passion. Here's Oladipo. Nifty move. Here's Otobio. A chance to extend the lead to double digits, but it's no good. They've been struggling here on offense. Yeah, a bit of a dry spell for sure. And it's Green with the jam. And how high can you fly? I mean, he finishes that one with some pop. GA after getting loose in the lane with a scintillating move. Oladipo taking his time here. Pass to Struce. And the Heat, another three. Last game for the Bulls, they picked up the W against Los Angeles. Bean passes to Green. To the inside, White. Good, and it's Green picking up the assist. He's got seven. I think you're going to see more and more of this from Kobe White. Challenging the defenders as a 6-5 guard. Hero passes to Tucker. And Oladipo has it in the corner. Lock at six. Takes the 13-footer. And it's White with the rebound. Bulls trail by seven. Knocked away. He can't get that one, and it's Miami the other way. Hero passes to Struess. He gets that one. It, it really does make the game easy for your teammates when you can lead them to the rim that well with a pass. And he's got his first chance at the line here. Max Struess at the line for one. Might be more talent at the point guard position now, Greg, than there's ever been in the NBA. But who do you think sits at the top of that list? I mean, Kevin, there's so many incredible talents. And not that I'm dodging it, but honestly, it, the beauty is in the eye of the beholder. It depends on what kind of tickles your fancy in terms of the point guard. If it's the ability to shoot and play without it, steps at the top of your lead list, but then you get a guy like Chris Paul, who I think is as good as anybody's ever been in the pick and roll. So they're, they're just different ways to approach this thing. And, of course, now I've forgotten four or five guys that I should have added into this conversation. Hero passes to Tucker. Oladipo outside. Some nice ball movement here by the Heat. And Tucker kicks to Oladipo. And there's the pass to Hero. Battles through traffic Tyler and lays Hero. it in. Hero's got the lead up to 12 now for the Heat. And just over three and a half minutes played here in the second quarter. And here's White. He has seven. Levine can't hit. And with the success they've had rebounding the basketball, they're right where you'd expect them to be firmly in the driver's seat. Hero, the bounce pass. And Adebayo throws it down. 
Some shooters get tunnel vision, but Tyler keeping his eyes up and his options open delivers a great pass. Time called here. The Bulls decide to talk it over. And the former Kentucky Wildcat, Tyler Hero, he was picked 13th break in the 2019 draft, and he had an immediate impact. And you feel a lot of teams didn't see how NBA-ready Hero was. Underrated as a playmaker coming into the league, he's been a huge part of this team since his arrival. Bulls making a switch here. Caruso's checked in. Kyle Lowry's checked in for the Heat. What concentration from the crafty swing man. Zach Levine enjoys scoring on aggressive defenders. Lowry with the ball. Now guarded by Vucevic. And he comes up with the deuce. Lowry. Lowry's got nine points. Working against size, he's just crafty enough to carve out some wiggle room. And that's tough to do from the mid-range because help can come from anywhere, but he beats everyone to the punch. Let's go now to the sideline and catch up with David Aldridge. Thank you, Kevin. After their trip to the NBA Finals in 2020, the Miami Heat is looking to get back to that championship round. Jimmy Butler says, we know what we're capable of. We want to get back to the finals. We can. I like our chances against anybody, honestly. Nobody intimidates us. Kevin? Second. Great attitude. They've shown they can compete at the highest level, David. Thank you. For Miami. for Miami, they have hit all four of their chances so far in this one. At the line for two. drops for Kyle Lowry. I love the leadership Lowry offers. It's very valuable. A great role model for his younger teammates. And so Lowry nails both of them. And they have yet to miss a shot from the line here this quarter. And here's White. He'll bring it up for the Chicago Bulls. It's a 16-point game. And there's Levine on the assist by White. White's got three assists now in this one. Terrific dribble move by Zach Levine. Blessed with the ability to create space to get off his shot. Here's Adebayo. 13 points in the game. Kicks it to Lowry. Passes to Adebayo. Five on the clock. The Heat need to get a shot off. They get it back. Here's Tucker. Off to a good start as he hits his first shot attempt. Plus eight in the rebound differential. One more reason why they're in control. Al Levine. He's got 16. And he slams it down. Right on top of Pam Adebayo. No denying Zach Levine's hop flies right up and sometimes over the hoop to jam it in. Pass to Struess. Over in the corner, Hero. Outside Lowry. Hero finds Lowry. Here's Struess. And a miss there on the triple. And close to making the defense pay for the lax coverage that time. Tyler Hero. And Tyler Hero gets the whistle that time. That's his first foul. Some changes for Chicago. DeRozan comes in for Green. And it's Dosumu in for Kobe White. Ayo Dosumu. Now here's Dosumu. Now recovering. Pass to Vucevic. DeRozan trying to get open. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. That's his second There's an element to Nikola Vucevic's game that fits well with most of the league's modern offensive scheme. And with his inside-out game, he's a guy that can stretch the floor. And Kevin, when you look at today's NBA, nothing is more important than spacing and passing. And when Vucevic is on the court, you can be sure the spacing will be excellent. And 
And the first one at the line is good. And one of the most underrated bigs in the NBA. Vucevic quietly dominates on a consistent basis. Good on both. Lowry with the ball. 11 points in the game. The pass to Autobio. Hero with it. Now guarded by Vucevic. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. That one on Vucevic. Often viewed as just a shooter. Tyler Hero can score, though, in a variety of ways, which makes him very difficult to defend. This is his first free throw of the game. And the first one drops. In Tyler Hero's defense, maybe not his strength, but it's an area he's looking to improve. You know what I like about him, though? He wants to improve, and that's half the battle. Balking up would help him as he gets bullied a little bit on those drives. You like that he wants to be more than just a score, G.A. Both shots good from the strike. Talk about being reliable at the line. At Kentucky, Tyler Hero, he hit 93% of his free throws his freshman year. Vujovic finds Levine. Good on the three-point shot. Levine's got 21. There it is. His first make from beyond the arc in the second quarter. His third of the game. Now, Hero, he's tightly guarded. Over to the left wing. Now, here is Lowry. He's got 11. Count the basket. Lowry. Lowry's got 13 points. Shooting at a high clip, he's found ways to get quality looks. Dosunmu, the pass to Vucevic. Dishes it to Levine. Misses the three. And they've got a big lead, not just on the scoreboard, but really in the rebounding numbers as well. Pass to Lowry. Here's Struce. He has six. Here's Hero. And it's Chicago with the rebound. Levine for three. And they'll get another chance. Here's Caruso. Now recovering. Six to shoot. Tries again. Caruso, no good. The Heat leading by 13. And here is Hero. He's got 13. He kicks to Lowry. That's in. That's his fifth field goal. He's shooting a hot 71%. Five for seven. The Bulls have gone 7 of 15 from the field here in the second quarter. Just under 50% shooting. It's DeRozan with the drive. And finished off by DeRozan. DeMar is so dangerous when he's attacking the rim. Great drive. Timeout. And the Heat call time here. And becoming more physical over the years. DeRozan converts off contact extremely well. We all know he's a tremendous athlete, GA, who's added a lot of strength. He adjusts well in the air, and he can finish with either hand. Hard to stop him once he's in the lane. Butler on the way. Now, here is Robinson. Tight defense on him. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. The physicality of Jimmy Butler poses so many issues for defenders. For Miami, they have been at their finest four at the free throw line tonight. Eight attempts, eight makes. At the line for two.
the first free throw is good. What's impressive about Jimmy is how much of a one-man army he can be. He makes the effort to be everywhere on the floor and does all he can to help his team. He hits both from the strike. Bulls trail by 15. They need a good offensive possession. Yeah, they've gone a long time without a bucket. There's Levine, and he converts the layup. Levine's got 11 here in this quarter alone. They're still behind, but not because of his efforts. He's been unbelievable this quarter. Outside Butler. And they double up Butler. And Robinson wide open. He shoots. Connects from three-point range. Robinson's got his first bucket of the game, and he's on the board for three. Now here's Dosumu. He's been patient so far. Nothing on the scoreboard yet. Here's Caruso. Offensive rebound. And all you got to do is look at the rebounding margin as to why they hold the lead. Effort's been there. Check mark. The physicality. Check mark. They set the tone for this game early on. Well, now that they've settled into this game, you can see the Two offense minutes. is firing on all cylinders. Yeah, the reason why they made the adjustments they needed to make. They are executing. Good ball movement here by the Bulls. Levine can't hit. Miami leading by 19 points. Robinson finds Lowry. Back to Robinson. Pass to Dedman. It's stolen by Vucevic. Now here's Dosumu. Now recovering. Two points. That one goes. Pretty much all of their buckets coming from inside the paint now. Outside Robinson. Lowry kicks the butt. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. Crafty play by Jimmy, sticking with his shot despite the close D to draw the foul. The Heat haven't made a mistake at the line yet. 10 of 10. In last season, as a team, they knocked down 79% of their free throws, so those are numbers you'll be happy with. Free throw, good Butler. Thompson, he's checked in for Chicago. Derek Jones comes in for Zach Levine. So he gets them both. 106 left in the first half of the game. Pass to Dosunmu. Thompson outside. Thompson is double. From past the arc. And there's the bucket from Dosunmu. Dosunmu's got five points in the quarter. And when you're a guy who plays with great finishers like Thompson has, you have to learn how to distribute. There's 45 seconds left in the first half of basketball. Robinson finds Deadman. Bounce pass Robinson. Down to five on the shot clock. Lowry passes to Butler. Over Jones. And it's good off the back rim and in. 14 points for Jimmy Butler. Yeah, and they're starting to warm up from the field this quarter. It's Jones with the ball for Chicago. They trail by 18. Five seconds separating the shot and game clocks. Shoots. 
And the Bulls tack on two more. Miami's gone three of five beyond the arc since the start of the second quarter. Now Butler. His last outing, he had 24 points. Outside for Robinson. Off target from outside. And so it's the Miami Heat with a sizable lead as the quarter wraps up. They're ahead, 16 points. And we'll see if they can keep up their tremendous shooting. They've been dialed in so far from the field. And now we'll send it over to David Aldridge, who is standing by courtside. David. Thanks very much, Billy. I heard you tell the guys to take it to them and play with more physicality offensively. What did you mean? Well, just I think when we're getting the ball inside around the basket, at times we got to go up a little bit stronger and play through the contact and go to the rim. Tough sledding in there, but you got to get there. Thanks, Coach. Appreciate it. Back to you. Okay, David, much appreciated. And now time for halftime. So we'll be back in just a bit to get the third quarter underway. The 2K Sports Halftime Show. Ernie Johnson here with Shaq and Kenny and a favorite time of the year as we're halfway through one of the first games of this fresh NBA season. Kyle Lowry has been the story in this one. He ended up with 15 points, two rebounds, and three assists. Kenny, let's start with you. What do you think about the Heat? They're getting to the line a bunch, and we know that. Being aggressive, not just settling for long-range jump shots and threes. There's a relentless nature to this basketball team. And we saw that in the first half. We'll see if they keep it up. And Shaq, what'd you think about Chicago? Their effort on the board has been horrendous. That's a good way to get blown out. Only way they could turn this thing around is to start winning the rebounding battle, to win the battle of possession. Otherwise, they're my favorite, avocado toast. And that's a wrap. With the third quarter approaching, we now send you back to Kevin and the crew. And as we dive into the second half, we'll find out if the next two quarters are any different from the first two. So far, it has been a runaway. You look at Zach Levine, he's really been playing well. The burst he's had when going at the rim has been fantastic. A lot of strong finishes through two quarters. His activity level has made an impact, and he is fearless. And there wasn't too much drama in the first half, but maybe things will tighten up here in the second. Bulls trail by 16. They've got Vucevic. DeRozan out there with Levine. Then there's Dosumu, and it's Caruso in at the two. That's Billy Donovan's five as we get going here in the second half. Levine kicks to Vucevic. That's good, and it's Levine with the assist. Vucevic has got the first basket of the second half. That one for the Bulls. Heat leading by 13. Butler on the way. Right wing. Adebayo against Vucevic. Here's Butler. And the Heat get Jimmy another bucket Butler. right there. I'm sure Coach is loving what Jimmy Butler is doing. Playing with real heart and getting his points. And for those of you turning in, we're about a minute into the second half. Butler against Levine. Some solid defense from Butler. The heat shooting has been fun to watch in this game. They're at 57%. Outside Lowry. It's stolen by DeRozan. Now the pass to Dosunga. Passes it to Caruso. Here's Vucevic. Shot clock at six. Here's Caruso. And the Bulls, another three. Alex Caruso. And Miami has possession. Earlier in the game, they had a 19-point lead. And at times, it just feels like DeRozan is still underappreciated. Receives a lot of criticism for what he doesn't do, and not enough credit for what he does. 
Bulls trail by 12. Levine with it. Robinson picks him up. Puts it up from 15. Another one falls for Chicago. Three out of four coming out of the half. Showing good execution on the offensive end. And DeRozan's talked about using negative press to his advantage. You know, he said, you have to be able to take criticism if you want to be great. Use the negative energy to become something more than you thought you could be. Lowry from outside. Again, the miss by the Heat. For Chicago, they've gone three or four so far in the third quarter from the field. Pretty good start to the hand. Miami leading by 10. Just over two and a half minutes gone by here in the second half. Three-pointer, Butler. And it's Chicago with the rebound. Levine's got five rebounds tonight. That's one for their first four to start the second half. Here's Vucevic. Good on the shot, and that changed the lead to single digits. Vucevic has got seven. Well, and it took a terrific effort at both ends to sustain this run. They've shown a lot of heart, a lot of fight. They're close to taking the lead. Timeout called the Heat. And, and Smitty, nobody's accused Levine of being a stellar defender, but the young man has improved in that area the last few seasons. Greg, he's always had the physical tools to be a good defender. It's been his awareness that's kind of held him back. But his weak side rotation and his D has gotten a lot better. Okay, well, let's check in with David Aldridge reporting from the sidelines. Well, the league remains in love with three-pointers, but DeMar DeRozan remains true to his game. He says, if I see 100 people walking left, that doesn't mean I'm going to the same. I see this clear path and want to stay right. Shooting threes, I feel like I'm settling. Whereas I think anytime I drive, I'm going to score or get fouled. Kevin, different strokes, with different folks. Yeah, but D.A., I love that strategy. Thanks for that score. Robinson. Attacking the defense with the pass, Butler understands the importance of keeping his teammates involved. Dosunmu, the pass to Vucevic. And here is Dosunmu. Five points in the game. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. It's going to be on Bam Adebayo. And really the defense fouling there to prevent the layup, but that's exactly what you need to do. All right, we'll look at how the points have been generated so far. Scoring breakdown for Miami. What tremendous passing we've seen from them today. A very unselfish performance all around. And also, guys, they take a lot of pride in their ability to rebound the basketball, especially on the offensive end. And that one misses. Well, probably a little draft in the arena tonight. He's the last guy you expect to miss the mark by that much. Absolutely. And he's good on the second. We're seeing a lot of top high school players opting for the G League over college now, Greg. What's your advice to top young players on their path to the NBA? And well, Kevin, I think you just answered it. It's their path. And I, and I don't think the same path is right for everybody. There are going to be a lot of talented young men and women who want to go to college for the experience, Bulls you know, for the environment, uh, for the networking, That's right? You're going to make some of the best foul. friends you'll ever have First team in, on a college campus. Having said that, though, some kids aren't in the college, aren't in the school. They want to just go and pursue their passion and their, their craft. And that's why I think the G League and the developmental leagues that are out there are so good for these young players. Autobio passes to Robinson. That's in coming off an assist from Autobio. Autobio's got his fourth assist with that last one here tonight. Bulls trail by 12. Pass to Vucevic. And there's the call. It's going to be an illegal screen. Beyond the lead, you can see his feet weren't set on that screen. Easy call. So difficult to stay planted, especially with all the motion around you. 
annoying turnover. Well, he leading by 12. Lowry with the ball. 15 points in the game. And denied. He sends it right off the glass. Outside DeRozan. Dosunmu, the pass to Caruso. Pass to DeRozan. From 16 feet away, he cans it. DeRozan's got 12. Man, he keeps doing his part. They just haven't been able to get over the hump. Now, here's Lowry. Now, Adebayo. Here's Butler. Rebound collected by Levine. Levine's got six rebounds here tonight. You know what, though? They keep calling his number despite the difficult quarter he's had. And so it's Butler with it. He'll bring it up for the Miami Heat. Kicks to Lowry. Tucker the pass to Butler. Good ball movement here by Miami. Adebayo finds Butler. It's good. Jimmy 18 Butler. points for him. Explosive athlete. The tenacity of Jimmy Butler. Too much to contend with. Chicago calls timeout, Chicago and the defense of Adebayo, top-notch Steve, all NBA level. And Kevin, and he's still improving. Bam Adebayo, as you know, has great timing and reach. He can act as a rim protector, but he can still switch out and hang with the guards. So for the Bulls, Thompson, he's checked in for Vucevic, and it's wide in for Dostumu. Martin's checked in for Miami. Oladipo comes in for Duncan Robinson. Here is Lowry. He's got 15. Outside Butler. Lowry passes to Autobio. Back to Lowry. And it's out of bounds to the heat as Miami retains possession. Miami ball. Five to shoot. Here's the three. Bringing a competitive energy to the defensive end. White stays connected to his man and plays with active hands. It's a plus five advantage for them in rebounding after that one. Butler deciding where to go with it. And it's White with the rebound. Bulls trail by 12. Driving inside. It's not going to go for him. Miami's gone one of four and three point shots here in the third. Outside Butler. And the pass to Autobio. Back to Butler. Fade away. And good. And it takes Jimmy a nice Butler. bounce off the right iron and down. Butler's got six here in this quarter. Chicago's gotten the three-point shot off 16 times tonight. Seven times they've hit it. Nine times they've missed. It's DeRozan with the drop. Oh, and the jam by DeRozan. When DeRozan gets to the rim like that, you know how it's going to end. Lowry passes to Butler. Outside, Mark. Butler against Levine. Pass to Oladipo. Rebound collected by Levine. Levine's got his seventh rebound of the game with that last one. Buries it down low. Levine's got 29. Each year, Zach seems to improve as a score. A testament to his strong work ethic. Timeout called the Heat. And <laughs> Jeremy, you tend to forget this about Levine. He's still so young. You feel like he's been in the league forever. Chicago making a switch here. Williams has checked in. 
And here's Lowry. 15 points in the game. Left side, Butler. And again, it's the Heat missing. You know, Greg, I was just thinking about Zach Levine and his age. He's just now in his mid to late 20s. And he's grown so much since that rookie year. Excited to see what numbers he can put up as he gets ready to enter into his prime. Pass to Oladipo. Outside, Martin. From outside, off the mark. Bulls trail by eight. DeRozan surveying the D. Pass to Thompson. Outside, White. Oladipo against Thompson. And the shot goes down. Thompson's got his first basket. And they're beginning to just flat out fall apart defensively right now, especially on the interior. The pass to Oladipo. Adebayo against Thompson. Lowry for three. That's in coming off an assist from Adebayo. Adebayo's got six assists here tonight. Now Chicago has gone two of two from long range in the third quarter so far. Over in the corner, White. Two minutes remaining. Rebound by the Heat. Adebayo's got nine rebounds now tonight. Oladipo misses. Chicago trailing here. To the middle, stolen by Martin. White against Lowry. Outside, Martin. Passes to Butler. Good ball movement here by Miami. Here's Autobio. And no good. And Chicago will go the other way with the ball. Pass to Thompson. Let's a floater go. And it's good on the way up. Thompson's got four points now in the quarter. Up in his playmaking skills, when Levine notices an open teammate, he whips the pass over. Lowry with the ball. 18 points for him. Martin, the pass to Autobio. He dishes it to Butler. Rocket six over Levine. And Butler gets it to go on the assist by Autobio. Butler's got 22. That shot was contested, but we forget Jimmy Butler is around 6'8". Shot over him. Here's White. Feeds it to Thompson. And the bucket is good. Three-point play chance here for him. The defense not putting up any fight on the inside. They've allowed 10 straight points in the paint. First trip to the free throw line for him tonight. So for the Bulls. The for the Bulls. Green comes in for DeMar DeRozan. And it's Jared Jones in One for Levine. Shot. Thompson no good on the free throw. One thing about Thompson, he's made improvements to his body and his game each and every year. Hero kicks to dead. Now Hero, D right on him. Banked in off the glass. Deadman's got his first points of the night. And we always talk about making your teammate better. That assist was right on target. to Jones. Now here's White. He's covered by Hero. White inside. Nine points in the game so far. Unable to get that one. Shoots from 12. Shots good by Hero. And now an 11 point heat lead. We see this a lot from Tyler. Instead of going all the way to the rack, he pulls up. And so it's Miami. Their lead at 11 points to end the quarter. They're playing a bruising game inside and it's working for them. We'll get right back to the action when we... Head coach Eric Spolstra mic'd up along the sideline. Let's check it out. All right. Put together 
three or four stops in a row. Come on, just concentrate on good basketball right now. From pressing it down to these few minutes, Sarek Spolster asking his guys to focus in defensively. And talking to one another, quicker rotations, the help has to be there on time if they want to come up with these stops. Tyler Hero. And as we head into the fourth, we'll see if there's a comeback in the works or if it's more of the same from the first three quarters. So with Butler sitting on the bench, this is who Eric Spolster has on the floor. Dwayne Dedman is out there with Martin. Then it's Tyler Hero. Then there's Victor Oladipo. And it's Cruz in at the three spot. Terrific play in the paint by Kobe White. Uses his athleticism to find a shot. It's Oladipo on the wing. White covering. Down low. Here's Dedman. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. That's his first personal foul. First team foul. At the line for the Heat, Dwayne Dedman. Two shots. Free throw drops for Dedman. Vucevic, he's checked in for Chicago. Williams comes in for Dosumu. And he makes both free throws. Bulls trail by 13. On the wing, Jones. The pass to Vucevic. Back to Jones. Offline with his three. And they've only got a slight edge on the boards, but it, it just feels a lot bigger. We play just over one minute here in the fourth quarter. Here's Hero. Yes, indeed, it is good. He's now eight for 14. Not lacking confidence. Love seeing Tyler go up strong with this one. They've been looking out of sync offensively. Yeah, the, their offense has ground to a standstill. And the officials will call the illegal side right there. And not the most common call you'll see in the NBA, but hard to argue. That pick wasn't illegal. It's often a tough call that can go either way, but I agree with you on that one. Miami leading by 15. We're just over a minute and a half now into the fourth. Hero passes to Dedman. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. The aggressive move by Dedman. Challenge mentality draws contact. Shooting for Miami, Dwayne Dedman at the line for two. First free throw is good. So he makes both from the line. Impeccable from the line since halftime. Outside Williams. Passes it to White. Shot clock at five. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. It's going to be on Victor Oladipo. A confident score with an attacking mindset. If you're the defense, don't let Kobe White watch you slipping. And with Kobe White, you hate to see him settle. He's best when going at the rim. The defense wins if he takes that mid-range jumper.
first one falls for him. And Greg with Kobe White, he's a solid shooter, but teams have keyed in on it. I just want to see him more in attack mode. He's a solid finisher when he gets in there, and it could take his game to the next level. And both free throws, good for White. Kobe White might be new to the league, but he doesn't play like it. Confidence and ability are beyond his years. Now, Hero, White covering. Struz passes to Oladipo. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. Breaker is talking about Oladipo. He holds a very high standard for himself. He's trying to reach another level every year. He wants to keep growing, making everything more consistent. And it's possible we still haven't seen the best of him yet. And he makes the first. The combination of shooting and speed Oladipo provides this team is invaluable. And his hunger to keep getting better, also impressive. Autobio is checked in for the Heat. And good on the second, so he makes them both. We're in the fourth quarter here, just under two and a half minutes gone. Here's White. Williams dishes to White. He kicks it to Green. Over Adebayo. Here's Vucevic. And a good offensive board. And he gets the button. And how about the hustle from Vucevic there on the glass, securing that precious second chance opportunity for the team. Now, Hero. He's covered closely. Struz passes to Adebayo. Yes, indeed, it is good. He's now eight for 14. They should continue to get the ball inside. The defense struggling to contain them. Williams looking over the floor. White left side. They kick it out to Green. And out of bio, sends it back. Huge block by Adebayo. Plays the game Caleb with aggression Martin. and shows That's no mercy. Second personal foul. Second team foul. At the line for the Bulls, Javante Green. Two shots. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And he knocks down the first one. The Heat making a switch here. Butler's checked in. And both free throws good for Green. And they came out of the locker room after halftime with a much more physical approach than what we saw in that first half. Heat moving the ball around. Butler against Jones. Oladipo for three. The shot's good on the Victor assist by Butler. Oladipo. Butler's got his three. fifth assist in this one. A solid all-around player. Jimmy Butler understands the importance of sharing the ball with open guys. Here's White, and that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle, and two shots coming up. And Kobe White in the open floor is a blur. Great burst with the ball. He can fly right by his defenders. He knows when to turn the Jets on GA. Very big part of his offensive production. The first one falls. <laughs> and 
and both free throws good for White. The Heat leading by 16. Now Hero. Out to the right wing. Adebayo against Vucevic. And oh boy, a lot of contact there, but he gets the call and will shoot two. That one on Vucevic. This is where Bam goes to work, which in turn draws the D's attention. Shooting for Miami. Bam Adebayo taking two shots. And he makes the first. Man, you know, Bam Adebayo knows his role, doesn't play outside of himself, and he's a quality teammate, too. The Heat making a switch here. Tucker's checked in. And Adebayo drops them both. Now White. Miami grabs the miss. Heroes got his seventh rebound of the game with that last one. A good board there, Kevin, but overall they're getting slightly out rebounded. Adebayo kicks to Hero. Butler up top. Vucevic defending. Butler passes to Tucker. Six on the shot clock. Butler against Vucevic, and it's Butler missing. Bulls trail by 18. Ball stolen. Here's Hero. And he jams it with Tyler authority. Hero. An aggressive score who hunts for his shot. Tyler knows how to get himself going. Miami and ball. another turnover here by Chicago. That's what happens when nothing goes your way. You start to lose focus, and it makes matters worse. Miami leading by 20. Outside Butler. Pass to Oladipo. And stolen by Williams. There's the dish to Vucevic. Kicks it to White. Steve, you played four years at Michigan State with all the changes, including pro options for the top prospects. Do you worry at all about the college game? Don't worry about it in some ways having more players who stick around is a good thing but i love the opportunity these young guys are getting continuity can lead to beautiful basketball they just have to make adjustments hero passes to tucker butler against green left side butler and there's another Jimmy one for the heat I love it. Got the basketball used to pick. A high percentage shot for Jimmy Butler off pick and roll plays. Pass to Vucevic. Dishes to White. Takes it inside. The shot's good on the assist by Vucevic. White's got eight points here in this quarter. The defense cannot afford to give him an inch that close to the basket because he will burn you every time. Oladipo, the pass to Butler. Now, Hero. White covering. Shots good Tyler by Hero. Hero. It's enough to where you have to respect him. Had one triple in the first half. Now has his second. And out of bounds as the Heat gain possession. Heat ball. Chicago Heat making some changes. Zach Levine's checked in for Jones. And it's Alex Caruso in for Williams. Robinson's checked in for the Heat. Kyle Lowry comes in for Hero. Here is Lowry. Greg, you've got the unique opportunity right now to watch your son Cole follow in your footsteps. 
What has changed for players now versus when you play? Well, I, I think Shoot the players foul. today are so much Nicolai smarter. Vucevic. And they prepare to be that's pros at such an earlier foul. age. And honestly, foul. I think that's one of the advantages our league has. Shooting you know, you don't have to teach Bam these guys Adebayo. responsibility. You may have Two to teach shots. them the game. But they are ready, willing, and able to work to achieve their goals. Here's what Chicago's going with right now. Tristan Thompson, he's checked in for Vucevic. DeMar DeRozan comes in for Green. And it's Dosumu in for White. He's off on the first. He hits the second from the line. For Chicago, they've gotten only three of their nine field goal attempts to go down since the end of the third. Pretty cold down the stretch. Caruso kicks to Levine. And he lays it straight in. Levine's got 31 points. He has definitely shown up to play. He's done his part, really just trying to battle his team back into it. Inside. Outside for Robinson. And here's Lowry. Outside Butler. Lock at six. Let's it go from deep. And DeMar DeRozan pulls it down. DeRozan's got his sixth rebound on the night. Dosunmu, the pass to DeRozan. Bulls moving the ball around. Levine can't hit. And he's going to have to wait to hit his first triple of this half. He had three at the break. Lowry with the ball. And the pass to Butler to the left wing. Adebayo against Thompson. And Adebayo throws it down. And we've seen a leak from Adebayo recently. Scoring now at a steady clip. Here's Dosunmu. It's hauled in by Bam Adebayo. The Heat have gone 8 of 10 from the field here in the fourth quarter. Really getting it done. Lowry dishes to Robinson. Passes it to Tucker. Levine against Butler. Over Levine. And it's Butler missing. Chicago's gotten off to an 0 for 2 start from downtown here in the fourth quarter. And DeRozan throws it down hard. Well, we're seeing the defense make adjustments, but DeRozan is making great reads, finding ways to counter. The drive by Lowry. And two free throws coming up, unable to get that one to go with all the content. And Greg, with recent legal results, more Team opportunities now for compensation for college athletes. For uh, do you like it? I do. I mean, there's enough money going At around. I don't two. have a problem with the athletes getting a share, uh, especially with the amount of time and effort and energy they have to commit. Let's take care of the guys. Let them enjoy the collegiate experience. And the first one at the line is good. And so Lowry nails both of them. And Chicago shooting in the fourth quarter has looked shabby, 38%. Now here's Dosumu. Pass to Levine. Off the mark there with the three-point shot. And the great shooters know when they've got enough opening to go for the three. I didn't think it was a bad choice on that possession. Adebayo finds Lowry. Three-pointer. Caruso grabs the miss. And Caruso's got the ball here for Chicago. He's looking for Levine and finds him. You know he's pulling his weight, but they still find themselves behind. Heat beaten by 22. Now Lowry. 
and the NBA dress code introduced back in 2005. Now, player attire straying a bit from business casual. Uh, does that bother you, Greg? You know, it doesn't bother me because that's where we are as a society. But then I can tell you, when I first came in the league, you could find if you didn't wear dress socks with your suit. So we have come a long way in terms of the evolution of fashion. And you know what? I'm not one for stopping progress. There's a minute 47 left in the fourth quarter of this one. They get a hand on it. And wrestling for it there, but no one has possession. We'll have a jump ball. And Chicago has possession. Now, here's Tucker. Defense right on him. And we're going to have a jump ball. It's tied up there. Chicago with the ball. Chicago has gone 0-3 so far in the fourth quarter from long range. Here's DeRozan, left side Levine, beyond the arc, good, and it's DeRozan picking up the assists. Levine's got 13 points here in the second half alone. And tonight's battle is going to end with a very clear winner, leaving nothing to chance. Impressive win for the Heat. The coaching staff must be happy that they controlled their turnovers so well in this game. Excellent self-control and patience tonight. And it'll go down as their first official win of the new year. And they cap off the season series with one more win. Three it's points. been nothing but W's. Four straight. Tough-minded individual. Lowry answers back with his own three on the other end. Now here's Dosumu while recovering. Pass to Caruso. Just five on the clock. And he can't answer back the three-pointer offline. Now here is Lowry. He's guarded closely. We've got 28 seconds left in the game. Now the pass to Autobio. And there's a foul. It goes on Jimmy Butler. That is his first foul of the game. Yeah, way to get there first and be willing to absorb the contact. for the Bulls. Ball against Lowry. The 10-footer. Outside for Thomas. Ball surveying the defense. Outside Thomas. And so Miami takes this one by a big margin. A resounding victory for them. And Greg in enemy territory, no less. That's exactly right. But with the way they controlled the game and, and just completely took the crowd out of it, that's how to get it done on the road. It's time now to go courtside as we send you over to David Aldridge from the sideline. David, take it away. Thanks very much, Bam. Your impact is seen all over the stat sheet. So what's the mindset as you approach these games? Trying to get a team win, trying to impact winning. You know, that's what it's all about. My teammates got my back like I got there. So he's just going out there and trying to do our thing. It was very visible there down the stretch. You looked like yourselves and got the win. Back to you guys. 